2021 Cool Breeze Invitational here at the Rose Bowl in Pasadena. Sean Brosnan, the coach from Newberry Park. The boys team usually gets a lot of the headlines. The girls were unveiled today. They're really, really good, and I think there are a lot of skeptics out there. I think today they showed, it wasn't even probably their best day, and they showed really well, won by, I believe, about 114 points over a second place team. Five of the top six girls teams, all divisions, were in this race. First off, what did you think? We won. How good is your, is this your girls team? Uh, our team that won by like 70, 80 points the state meet in 2019, head and shoulders better. Much, much better. This one is much, D much better. It's deeper. We have, we can, our, our five, six is replaced. I mean, they're constantly going to change. Um, much better. I, I think, I mean, we, we would beat our 2019 team by significantly a lot. Um, where we were for our 2019 team at this time of the year, we're way ahead of that. Like I said, I don't think today's performance was amazing, but it was good, it was solid. Obviously, the win's a win, um, but we, we have other goals we're trying to get set up for. So, forget about on paper. You have a kid came in to transfer. You've got a freshman. You've got still some downtime. So there were some question marks. Yeah. So this wasn't, like I said, on paper, but you had to prove some stuff today. Yeah. And, and the girls, in other words, you had girls that were in new situations for themselves. Yeah. yeah I, I think they did. Right I, I think they did great. You know, I mean, I, I told the girls right before the race, I said, it's time to live out of the guy's shadow. Enough of living in the guy's shadow. It's always like MP guys, MP guys. But now it's like, I, I mean, we're going to be the guys and the girls. Our girls, our guys are phenomenal. And our girls, we can be phenomenal. We can. I mean, we, we have high goals. I mean, we want to, we want state title we want nxn we want to be on the podium and we're not there yet but we have three months or just short of three months and that's what that's that's the thing it's like this is early we worked really hard this week there was a risk really hard work on monday okay. but it's like what are we gonna do we can't rest now i mean it's, it's just the beginning of september so given all the scenarios what were you most pleased with is any particular girl that really you were most pleased with today you know um you know, Ailish was good. She stepped up second position. But I, I like Danielle. I mean, Danielle has been running that six seven, and she and she she covered for. You know, we had some stomach issues with Morgan or something. So it's like we, she stepped up and covered that. You know, that's what you need. You, I always say, if you want to be a good team, you got to win the state championship without our one girl. You got to win without the one. I told it to my guys in nineteen. You got to be able to win without Nico. We got to win without our one, and that's the whole thing. You know, I, I, I thought Sam was off today. Just not. But again, we're working hard. This is the beginning phase of us for this next two months it's hard work you know we, we really get ready for november it's it's risky to race them here but it's like I, I thought we had something to show with the girls i said let's go show what we're doing let's train through this and let's go show who we are because i don't think people thought we were as good as we are you know quick update with the boys your top 60 didn't run i think your sevens did run right a battle no run no I, I didn't have anyone all no seven top out. seven you all seven out okay. So update I, on them. How are they looking right now in workouts? Um, really good. Really, really good. Everyone, Colin's away at a recruiting trip right now. Uh, we had guys do a four-mile tempo out on the road outside here today because they wanted to come and support the girls. So they're all here doing their thing. And, you know, they're ready to go. I mean, it, it's uh, we don't know what we're doing. I think I've said this before. Our plan is to open up. Uh, originally, was to open up in Arizona. Course got changed. We weren't too happy with that. So we're like, we're going to open up at Woodbridge. Might be an ax on that. We might open up at Clovis. I just look at the long term, where they're at, maybe run one or two of them. I don't know. I, I just don't know yet. We're going to make this decision next week of what we're going to do. I just, I, I want I want to do what's best for them long term. And, and they want to do what's best. And it's just trust and say, okay, where do we want to be at the state meet? Our goal is that state meet and that national championship. That's our, that's really our only goal with those boys. You said next week, probably the decision will be based on certain markers you have or a gut? Just gut, how they feel, tired, what's going on. We had some really good workouts earlier this week. Um, next week won't be as hard, just the way our training is. So I just want to see like how they're reacting on it. I, I don't know. It's hard to say. I, I kind of, I'm a real uh, women and women coach. I kind of watch and I want to see how they feel and I'll just make the decision. I, I think we probably will, but I just don't know. I don't want to commit to it yet. And that's kind of how I am too. I'm always week by week, which is bad sometimes, but. Have you with the girls already? Most race or no? Talk with them already or not yet? What was that? Have you talked with the girls already? I have, I have. Not really about their race. I mean, I, I just, I, I, well, I told them to cool down and get going right away, but um, we just talked and they got their awards over there. And I mean, 
I don't. I'm happy, but I'm not satisfied. Yeah, I, I, we have more. We have more. But but we did our job. I think we we proved we're better than certain teams that people were like. I mean, I was getting texts too. Like, ah, this is crazy. How are you guys ranked number one in Southern Section? I said, I'll show you Saturday or Friday. Yeah. So it was good. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, last question. You mentioned calls on a trip. What is it? Uh, he's in Oklahoma. Yeah, yeah. He has, he, he's he's down to three right now. So I don't know if I'm allowed to review. That's I can say no. I think he's I think he's UNC, Oklahoma, and NAU. Right. So those are his three. And there might maybe unless he adds one in, I don't know. So I, I haven't. I, you know, we talk about it a lot, but it's you know he'll he'll make his decision soon. I think. All right, Sean. Great job with the girl for this year. Both my rocket. Ready to go. Yeah, thanks.